Hi, it's Julian, and in this video, we're going to take you through the top 10 activities that we use when we're trying to get rid of creative block. So we all get it. It happens to the best of us. We turn up for work or we're looking at our screen and we just can't think of anything. Nothing seems to kickstart our creative juices. So these are our top 10 tips, tried and tested, that will help you get your creative mojo back. They're not in any particular order. Grab the one that's speaking to you. So the first one, you find yourself staring at the screen, looking at a blank piece of paper, and you just can't start. And this is the one, just get up and do something different. Take a break, grab a coffee or a tea, you're done. Number two, grab someone else to give you a different perspective. Remember when doing this, be open to what they say. It's easy to say, yeah, I thought about that and shut them down, but build on their thoughts. Your idea will be better for it. Carl, you got a sec. Yeah. Number three, change your routine. Maybe go and explore a different part of the city. Go to work via a different route. We found this location recently. Fourth one is going to your local museum or gallery. It's a great place to see modern art as well as some classics. Okay, this is the fifth one. It's a little dangerous, so do it at your own risk. You need to grab a chair, stick it on top of a table, and then climb onto that chair and see your office in a whole new light. Okay. Again, it's something about the new horizon and perspective that breaks the dam. I've used this so many times. It's incredible how often it works. Now it's just a case of getting down. Okay, number six, over halfway now. This follows on from some of our recent videos around user-centered design, and it's all about designing for that user. So if you know them, start thinking about what they would want. And if you're not sure, maybe pick up the phone and see if you can meet for a coffee and chat. Okay, the seventh one is for all you dog owners. Go for a walk with your dog. Get the ball. Give it a throw. Let's walk. Number eight is do something all consuming. For me, that's climbing. Climbing tires me out both mentally and physically, and so I come back refreshed to other challenges. And often this allows me to break my creative block. Oh, and it's fun. Number nine, don't make this a routine. Stay up late, watch cracking movies all night. Okay, so number 10. Well, I'm not really sure I got stuck here. I thought you might be able to help us out and tell me your favorite way of stopping creative block in the comments. So thanks again for watching. Hope these help you in the future and see you in the next video.